Hey, it's time at Dish with D. That's me. Thank you for clicking on this video. It is Food Fights Friday. Look where I'm at. I'm at the Dollar Tree. Dollar 25 tree, though. Let's see if we can find in here and score for low points. Come shopping with me. All right, we're going into the Christmas tree shop. First, I'd like to start off with the shelves weren't as great as they usually are. So I might have to revisit this video in a, maybe a month or two because I was slightly disappointed because normally they have a lot more on the shelves. I'm seeing a lot of empty shelves where I'm going. So, but I did show you some other things because I just, this video would have been like three minutes. Oh, look what I came into. <gasps> yes, the mini loaf pans and little ramekins and all the cute little decorative things you could put. I had to show this stuff because, you know, just because you're on a weight loss journey doesn't mean your food can't be cute. Putting cute little pics on stuff and little cupcake wrappers. I mean, look at the cute little cookie cutters. So, yeah. But look here at some of the, look at the, these, these little um, pumpkin pans. You can make, again, we can make cute little pumpkin things for our journey. And they had a lot of decor, so I thought I'd show you some of the cute decor because, like I said, the food was pretty, pretty scarce. So we're going to do some cute decor for the holidays. And um, yeah, this stuff I wouldn't hang outside because it's kind of would warp, but they really had some cute decor things and stuff for Halloween. And look at that funny guy. But yes, yeah, spiders galore freak me out a little bit. I don't like spiders, but I thought I'd show you some of this and then we'll get to the food because I'm really sad that they didn't have more than what I saw. But there's some more. Look at the cute little, you know, buffalo check pumpkins and all the fun little things and there. Oh, look, Christmas. Yeah, Christmas stuff is out. Not all of it, just a little bit. We have some more stuff over here. And always check your end caps when you go to the Dollar Tree because they have some really fun stuff on the end caps as well. You just can't go wrong with some cute decor. Cards. I wanted to mention that some cards are a dollar and some cards are two for a dollar. So if you need cards, I say check the two for a dollar first and then go to the dollar ones because you just don't know. But yeah, a lot of people get their cards there. So they're the ones, a dollar. And these are two for a dollar. So yeah. And they have great wrap and bows and stuff like that at the Dollar Tree. So I would say if you need a gift wrapped, I'd say go here first. Lots of cool gift bags. I mean, it's, honestly, they, they really have really great stuff. And it's still, I think, cheaper than going to Target. Maybe. If I'm wrong, let me know because maybe I am. Yeah, I don't know. Hey, I don't claim to know everything. <laughs> so there's your cleaning and your paper products. As far as the eye can see and fun little balloon stuff. Yeah, there's craft stuff. I don't think I'm going down that aisle. Let's just keep going. Keep going, D. Books. Now you, sometimes you can get some cool killer books here. I will tell you, I've got many a good cookbook in this dollar store. Not this particular dollar store, but in a dollar store. So always check your book section, especially if it's a new Dollar Tree. Lots and lots of puzzle books. Yep. Great, great selection of puzzle books and coloring books for the kids, grandkids. Like I said, in the mailing section, you need to mail stuff out. They got a lot of stuff like that. Sometimes you might not know that the Dollar Tree carries because you just never get in certain things. And they have a nice school supply section and they have a nice teacher section. So if you're a homeschooler, you get a lot of resources here for you to do that. And the candles. Now, I will tell you, the candles, some of them are really nice, but they don't burn very long. So just be careful. Re realize you're only paying $1.25. So yeah, but some of them really smell nice. And these, the sugar-free Werther's Originals. Yep, they're always good to grab if you need a sweet little candy treat. They have a good selection here. I'm look, still looking for the pumpkin, but I haven't found it yet. And what I wanted to show you down here is the little bags of little candy. Like, if you eat a whole bag of this, it's not going to be, you know, it's not going to take all your weeklies. So sometimes if you need to have a candy fix, just getting a small bag like this in case you tend to overeat it. And look at the jerky. Nice selection of jerky, I will say. And jerky is really high in protein and the dried fruit. Now, all this dried fruit that I show you here and Harvest Snaps has no added sugar. I like that. Like I, I think I, they have mangoes, pineapples, and apples. Look. 60 calories for the whole bag and no added sugar. So quite honestly, I wouldn't count it. In my personal opinion, there's no added sugar. It's just an apple. So not that I'm eating a bag of dried fruit. Ah, yes, the water enhancers. Again, these have way more than this. 
and, and sometimes um, you can get the um, protein drinks here and there's some sugar-free teas the only had was this one which I didn't really care for so but you sometimes you can get um, premier here it's, it's hit or miss let's like anything else let's close out stuff sometimes they have a low sugar juice they have those little iced coffees which are really nice oh look at that little tuna packs there we go they're always good to have honestly for a quick lunch better than you know some other things we can grab little pioneer gravies and some pasta salads some instant mashed taters some canned tomatoes lots of veggies and the spices and not too bad a price for spices um yeah i mean like i said you really should re replace your spices often because they do lose lose their flavor sometimes so you know paying a dollar 25 you can pitch them after a while and they have cake decorating which i didn't have before this is all new. I've never seen that at the Dollar Tree. And of course, there's some teas. And there, there's no sugar-free or light juices today. A little disappointed. They only have the high ones. But I like this little tea. It's unsweetened. And look at these. These are the dupes for the um, Fiber One bars. And your Belveda dupes. And what do we... Oh, yes. I always just grab the chicken broth when I'm here. It's not... It's actually pretty tasty. Yes, I buy canned broth. No sugar-free puddings. Ah, uh, look at all this section of mustards. You know me, girl loves mustard. Where are we going now? Oh, over here. Oh, look at the teas and coffees. The green tea's pretty good, but I have to use two bags. <laughs> I will tell you that. It's really good, but I have to use two bags. Some frozen stuff. Sometimes this is hit or miss too, what you could find. Look, the little smart breaks. That's a really good snack. Pickles. A really good snack. I mean, you know, sometimes you can get a good score and sometimes you can't. Oh, yes. Skinny, no sugar syrups. Yeah, a few of the ones. I know I already have these at home, but yeah, there you go. That's really good. That Teev brand is really good tea. Coffee. Look at this. You can even get some no calories sweetener equal and the mugs i love a good cute mug that are a dollar 25 with cute sayings on them what a cute little gift for somebody this is the time to get them because they're all fully stocked put some a gift card in there for a teacher or some candies that's the one i do my mug cakes in y'all compliment me on my um dishware that i use in my videos and i get it at the dt and you'll see you'll see a couple of things that i use i have that plate Yes, I do. I have, where is, I have that plate. I have the bowl that matches. There it is. I do my oatmeal bowls in there. I love that bowl. I love the shape of it. So that is what, you are my secret where I get my stuff. And you get some cute jars for your overnight oats because just because we're weight loss journey doesn't mean our food can't be fun. I love jars, storage jars. Fun glassware, having a glass, having a drink in a fancy glass makes it feel a little bit more elevated. Just because it's iced tea doesn't mean it has to be an, an ugly glass. There's some really cute ones here. And the container section. Oh, and the baskets. Yeah, I did get a few. You'll see in the hall at the end of this video because I needed a few storage items. I love, love this bowl with the spout, the handle. I love that one. And look, Blabliglios, those are seven points for the whole tray, and that Mega Bowl is eight points for the whole thing. I will show you a still, I think, of the Mega Bowl. And these are some frozen fruits. Hey, there's zero points, so there's no added sugar. But yeah, this Mega Bowl right here is eight points for the whole thing. Can't beat that with a stick. And, of course, you can't go to Dollar Tree without going to, look at that, masks, <gasps> foot masks, ham. This is the time to get your masks for gifts. Again, put a few of those masks in a mug for a teacher. I love that toner right there. It's That is my favorite toner from the Dollar Tree. Love it. It feels so good on my skin. And there's all different fun stuff. You can pamper yourself on a weight loss journey because it's not all about food. Sometimes we need to pamper ourselves and go to the DT. It will not break your point bank or your, your wallet either. More masks, more fun things. Oh, yeah. Look at that. The eye roller is really nice. I've used that. That's really nice, too. 
They're really nice, like I said. Little masks make you feel so good. What do, oh, what do we have here? The lip and eye mask. Very nice, very refreshing. Because we're going to show you to take care of our bodies as well as our tummies. But yeah, the makeup's pretty good here. If you get the, the um, LA Colors brand, it's pretty nice. So I thought I'd just give you a little overview. Like I said, the makeup seems to be more fully stocked than the food. The food was pretty, pretty empty. Okay, we're going to do the haul from the car because I'm waiting for my friends for lunch. So, hey, I'm, I'm utilizing my time well. So let me show you what I got at the DT. I was a little disappointed. They didn't have a lot of snacky stuff. Sometimes they do and sometimes they don't. I think everybody's suffering with the um, getting supplies and stuff. Even the Dollar Tree starting to see a hit. So I did go to Acme to pick up something else and I did get two treats there that I will share as well. So I did get... This is not all food, of course. I did get a calendar. I have this one from last year. I really like it. I hang it up and it has a notepad and a little list pad. So it's really cute. Like that. And... Napkins for Thanksgiving. No shame in that. They're so cute. They make the table look so festive. And I thought this was really cute. It's a soft touch surface. Notes, notes, notes. I love little notepads with lines. I put all my YouTube ideas on there. If I'm doing like a product review for a company, I write a lot of information. If you ever see me look and read, it's usually a pad like this that I'm reading off of. So I think that was, I love the way it felt. I think at these, I love these. I think these were three points. These Greta's crackers, you get, I think you get four crackers. We'll go over these. I'll, I'll definitely um, come back and go over these. Um, they're 120 calories. Three grams of protein. They're really cute. They are garden vegetable. These are really, I like to have these with a salad. Really good. I did show you they had quite three different things of dried fruit. This is 100% fruit. It's no sugar added, so there's no added sugar. So to 60 calories, I don't worry about it because there's nothing added to it. I know Weight Watchers tells you to count this, but I'm gonna, first of all, I wouldn't eat the whole pack anyway. I would just put it as like a little topping on something. But I did get the pineapple. They had mango and they, I was looking for strawberry. They didn't have that. And what was the other one? Apple. Sugar-free soft caramels. I need these for something. I can't remember what it was. I don't know. So I grabbed them. And I got two cards because they are two for $1.25. So I got two of those. I like this tea. It is unsweetened. I've never had the raspberry. I've had the regular. I mean, it was lemon and I had the peach. So I'm going to try the raspberry. I'm into raspberry tea, which is hilarious because I never liked raspberry in, in previous lifetime. Mm -hmm. I did break down and get one of these. Um, I like the size. I'm afraid of the decal, you know, baking on there. But a lot of you have hauled these and I thought, what the hell? So I got one. You did see they had the mini loaf pans there as well. So this was a great shape for a mug cake. You know, a baked oatmeal would go perfect in this. So that's why I grabbed that. And just for future giveaways, I got my favorite foot masks and hand masks. These are a deal. If you see these at your Dollar Tree, grab them. And this I thought was interesting. I didn't do enough research. I didn't have time, but it was infused lip oil. I'm always, you know, with chapped lips, and I think this would be nice and moisturizing. So I thought, um, I did show you my favorite coconut lip balm in there. I'll say it in the video, but I thought this would be neat to try. Let me see what it looks like. Oh, it has a, I love it. It has a little spout. Oh, this is going to be cool. I thought this would be really, see, it's like this. Has no taste but it's interesting i think lip oil it might be hydrating so i thought for when the winter comes that this might be a great thing i got a few baskets because you know i like when i get their baskets in i got two of these they're just red i thought these would be great in the kitchen because my kitchen is red and i love the aesthetics of this little basket so i got one of these in black and i did get two of these square gray ones um to put underneath my sink 
in the bathroom in my and I'm redoing underneath my sink so I thought we would just like one could be for my hair dryer my curling iron my I have like several hair care products down there so I thought that would be great to organize that so I did get that so that's all I got at the Dollar Tree but this is where I got the Acme because I was looking for turkey pastrami which I found at the last pack it was meant for me to get so I forgot about these these were really big back when smart points first started and I totally forgot about them. So I'm like, this just looked really good. It is two points. It is a protein one, 90 calorie protein bar. It has 10 grams of protein. I thought that was a great, you know, little thing. And they had a peanut butter and a strawberry, but this just piqued me. So I'm like, yeah, I forgot about these. And um, their other one, which is this one, has a Weight Watchers insignia on it. This is, you know, again, forgot about these too. Um, soft baked bar cinnamon coffee cake for two points and is Weight Watcher approved. It has personal points on there. So yeah, forgot about these too. How many, is there any protein in these? Two grams of protein, 70 calories. How many, how, how much fiber, baby? Six grams of fiber. Is there any fiber in this one? Five. Again, we forget sometimes we forget the old the old favorites so absolutely and i did show you that they had these dupes in the dollar tree i don't know if i scanned the label though i mean i scanned the label i know it was two points i don't know if i scanned the nutritional information what the calories were and the protein sometimes i do sometimes i don't because you know it was crowded in the dollar tree today i'm not sure what the heck that was about why all these people were in the DT, but they were. Maybe because it's a new DT and it has some really cool stuff. But it had a lot of holiday and I tried to show you a little bit of everything. Um, the mugs were really great. The cute little mugs, I thought they were awesome. Um, you know, make a great little gift. You put a little gift card in there, some chocolates, and to a teacher, to a bus driver. You know, it's really, really cute. So I just love the sayings on those mugs. And you always see the mugs that I use for my mug cakes are there. I pointed those out to you as well. So that is the DT. I'm a little bit, I will say it's, I wasn't, there did have that breakfast bowl I showed you in the freezer section. So it wasn't, you know, and they had frozen fruit, which I've never seen in our Dollar Tree before. So, but I was a little disappointed. I'm not gonna lie, but we will see what, what next week's spring. I think next week we're going to Dollar General, I think. Don't worry. I'm going to hit, I'm going to hit them all in the local area. So I hope you enjoyed this video. You seem to love these and I am so happy you love them because it's fun to go out there and behind people's backs, you know, because I don't let people see that I'm filming because sometimes you're not allowed to film in stores. And I'm not really filming, I'm just filming products for you guys. Hey, I'm giving them business, so. So that is it. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up. Let me know down below. Give me some store ideas. We'll see if they have them locally, so you just never know. Maybe I can go to Wegmans, but Wegmans is big. Wegmans could be a two-parter, part A and part B. We do have a Wegmans in Cherry Hill, which is not too far from the Whole Foods and Sprouts is that way. So we'll see, you know, too many stores, one day we'll get there, but I do appreciate you guys enjoying these and it's they're fun to do. They really are. I like the format, you know, we do the voiceover, but, and uh, that is it. I will dish with you another day. If you haven't yet hit that subscribe button, join us here on Dish With D. I would love it to have you part of the Dish With D community of Waste Watching Warriors. We're, we are slaying poundages one at a time and these videos help that and give you plenty of ideas so i love it so we will dish later thank you for watching and later gators